In this video, we are going to learn adverbs of frequency. Let's start. What are adverbs of frequency? First, let's look at this word frequency. Frequency. Frequency means how often something happens, something repeats, usually a verb, an action. So, because it's something that repeats, adverbs of frequency is very commonly used with the simple present verb tense because the, prism, the simple present verb tense talks about habits, things that repeat. Adverbs of frequency answer the question, how often? For example, how often do you study? I study every day. So this action of studying repeats every day. How often do you work? I always work. How often does your sister exercise? She never exercises. How often does your family go out to eat? We go out to eat once a month. You can see we have many different types of adverbs of frequency. The adverbs of frequency are always colored so that you can see them clearly. When we think about adverbs of frequency, you need to understand that we have two types of adverbs of frequency. We have the definite adverbs of frequency. This means that the time is specific. If it's not exact, that's okay, but we at least understand time. That's what we mean by time is specific. We can understand time. For example, every day, every week, every month, every Monday, every weekend, after you use every, you want to use a singular noun, like every Monday, every month, every week. So we have the definite adverbs. They show us time, specific time. And we have the indefinite ad adverbs of frequency. The indefinite adverbs don't show specific time. That means that the time in the indefinite adverbs, the time is harder to understand. For example, indefinite adverbs are always, usually, often, sometimes, never. When we listen to these adverbs, we don't know exactly when it happens. That is why they are called the indefinite adverbs. Here are some examples of definite adverbs. Here are all of the examples of different ones and how to use them in the sentence. Here are the example sentences. It's important to know that the definite adverbs of frequency can be used at the beginning or at the end of the sentence. It's your choice. Some adverbs of frequency have the same meaning, but we have different ways to say the same thing. For example, you can say every hour or you say hourly. Every day, daily. Every week, weekly. Every month, monthly. Every year, yearly. One time, once. One time every week, every month. Once every week, every month. One time a week, once a week. Two times every day, twice every day. Two times a month, twice a month. So the lines here means that you can use any time you want, week, month, year, so that you can add it there. The definite adverbs of frequency, remember, show us specific time. We understand the time. So that's why we use them at the beginning of the sentence or we use them at the end of sentences. He checked his email hourly. Every day she works. Just like I use hourly here, if I don't want to use hourly, I can use every hour. For example, he checked his email every hour. If you use the definite adverb at the beginning, don't forget to use a comma. Pause the video here to study this page more carefully. The second type of adverb of frequency is what we call the indefinite adverb of frequency. And what this means, again, it says that the time is a little bit harder to understand. It's not exact.
indefinite adverbs of frequency show us time, but it's time that is not specific. It shows us a percentage of the time. Zero, the lowest, it means never, I never do this, zero percent of the time. This action never happens. Or the middle, sometimes the action happens, the verb happens, sometimes. Or it always happens 100% of the time. When you use indefinite adverbs of frequency, the location, the syntax is important. Usually, the adverb comes before the verb, like this. Hannah always runs in the mornings. Tabitha and John never eat before 7 a.m. We use the adverb before the verb, except for the verb be. The verb be and other helping verbs use adverbs of frequency differently. This means that with the verb be, you need to use the verb be first, then the adverb second. It is a different order, different order for the verb be because the verb be is special. So for the verb be, you use the verb before the adverb. Before the end. This page shows you one more time the correct order for indefinite adverbs of frequency. The adverb goes before the verb for all verbs except for the verb be. We use the adverb after. Look at the examples of the adverb before the verb, adverb before the verb, adverb before the verb, and examples here of the verb be before the adverb, the verb be. Okay, now let's practice. Here is practice number one. You have 10 questions with the how often frame. How often do you, how often does your family? You need to answer these questions. In your sentences, use adverb of frequency. Maybe the definite adverb of frequency or maybe the indefinite adverb of frequency. Okay. Now, everybody is different, so your answers are probably different, but here are some possible answers. How often do you exercise? I exercise every day, so I'm using definite here. If I use indefinite, I use it here like this. I never exercise. How often does your family eat together? My family eats together once every week. I have here my definite adverb. Or if you want to use an indefinite, adverb in your answer, here is an example. A family always eats together. Pause the video here to study the possible answers. Here are the rest of the answers for number 6 through 10. Pause the video here to study these possible answers. Okay, now let's do practice number 2. I want you to try to make sentences about your family and their schedule. For example, think about the adverb, like always, usually, often, sometimes, rarely, never, the percentage, and try to make some sentences about your family. Here are some examples to help you get started. Pause the video here to make 10 sentences about your family. Okay, and one more practice. It's time to write more about you, about yourself. So you need to write a sentence with the words given, but you need to add an adverb. For example, if I tell you this, speak English at home, you need to make it a complete sentence. Use a subject, maybe an adverb, a uh, indefinite adverb of frequency, the verb, and then your object and prepositional phrase. You have six different sentences to complete. Please pause the video here and do them now. Here are some possible answers. Please pause the video here to study these possible answers. Okay, so in this video, we learned a lot of information about adverbs. We learned that adverbs of frequency show how often the verb occurs, how often the action repeats. That's why we use this adverb 
with the simple present tense. The adverbs of frequency answer the question, how often do you? And the, there are two types of adverbs of frequency. The syntax order is different too. You need to understand the difference between the definite adverbs and the indefinite adverbs. Thank you for watching.